it going? It's that nerd Ryan here. Welcome to the toy review of the Dragon Ball Super Nappa figure. Um, so happy to get this figure. It's the last one that I was missing in the uh, collectors or in the Super Series for now. We already got Vegeta on the back. There's his side art right there. Let's go ahead and take him out of the box and see how he is. All right, and here's Nappa out of the box. I again. I'm just ecstatic to have this figure finally. I've been trying to get them like just on regular um, like shopping sprees, but could never find them and I was able to get them on Amazon. Um, the only issue is his hands are so hard to put on, we're not going to be able to do a switch in the video. I do apologize. I couldn't even get this one on for pictures. So that is a big issue with this figure unfortunately. But um, other than that, it looks just like Nappa. Here's a quick 360. I always forget that Nappa has a tail, um, as you can see. And for whatever reason, I always forget that. Probably because he never got an Ozaro form in the show. He is six and a half inches tall. Another cool feature, I don't know if it was intentional or not, is you can remove the uh, fins to kind of give him a different looking suit. Obviously I don't think he had something close to this in canon either but still it's pretty cool to think of. But yeah I mean for one of the the one of the second main bad guys that ever have to get faced off in Dragon Ball Z it's pretty cool to get him. Obviously I hope we could get like 16 and uh other stuff like that as I try to put this on give me a hard time for some reason there we go but uh yeah I mean it's nice to get Nappa maybe we should get Raditz too though so head can rotate 360 go up and down side to side a little bit arms can go up like that and that uh rotate at the bicep triple elbow joint hands can rotate and move around as well no real torso action Legs can go like so, twist at the thigh, bend at the knee at a triple joint, and feet can move as well. So all in all, a good figure, just hard to switch out the hands, unfortunately, um, which I don't know if they showed up on camera, but these are the hands. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and give them a 7 out of 10, just because you can't use the accessories you get with them. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Be sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe, ring that bell, and follow me on all my social media down below. It's That Nerd Ryan, signing off.